vision, mission, and purpose. These are three very important concepts that may often get a little confused, and today I'm going to walk you through a couple ways to think about them differently, how they relate, and how to actually start creating your own for your business, nonprofit, or whatever it is that you're working on. First off, why does this even matter? When we're starting a business, nonprofit, whatever it is, even personal brand, we wanna connect with the people that we're serving, our audience, our customers, whoever that may be, and really be clear on what we believe, what we're doing, why we're doing it, how we're doing it, and really get that message across so that they know if we're a company or a brand or whatever that they wanna work with and that they could benefit from. Clarity is really the secret sauce of success in so many ways, and when we're clear on what we're doing, we can better communicate that through our messaging so that our audience and our customers can also be clear on what we're all about. So let's start with defining each of the three terms. The first one is vision. Vision is the what of your company. This is gonna be the big picture. It's going to be the kind of the long-term end goal idea that you wanna to contribute to and the reason that you exist. Your vision really focuses on the impact that you wanna make as well as what that will look like when you achieve those results that you're working towards. Next is your mission. Your mission is the how of your company. It lays out the path of how you will work towards that vision and how will you actually achieve those results that you're looking to make. It's the vehicle or the way or the how that we accomplish our purpose that we'll get to next in order to turn that vision into reality. And finally, the purpose is your why. Why are you doing what you're doing? Why does it matter? Why is it important to you? Why is it important to the world? What is the reason that you exist at all? This purpose will guide your decisions, guide your goals, and ultimately that impact that you're trying to make. So now let's talk about how they relate to one another. You can think about your vision as kind of that destination point of your purpose. So something that you reach once you create that impact that you're trying to make. Your mission is how you take action on that purpose in order to make progress toward that vision. And ultimately, purpose is the foundation of the other two. Once you're clear on your purpose, you can then decide what your goal is and what you're even trying to achieve, as well as how you're gonna go about that. So now let's talk about how to actually craft your own vision, mission, and purpose for whatever it is that you're working on. So like I said, purpose forms the foundation because without having some sort of reason of why you're doing this or why it's important, why it's meaningful to you, then you can't really have the other two, mission and the vision. So let's start there. Let's start with crafting our purpose. Let's start by asking ourselves a bunch of questions. Think about things like, why do you do what you do? What are your values? Why does any of it matter to you? Why does any of it matter to anyone else? If money weren't a part of this at all, would you still do what you do? And why would you do what you do? What would happen if you weren't involved in this, if you didn't do this? Why is this a needed thing in society or in someone's life or in your life as well? If you can answer all those kinds of questions like that, then you already have the beginnings of a purpose statement. And while this is something that we're really crafting for the company as a whole, if we start off by thinking about it in our own terms and how it matters to our own story and our own lives, then we can figure out really at the core why it's most meaningful to us, which then extends to our own business, and we can craft it in a way that really applies to the whole company. But at first, we really need to start with why we're doing any of this you know, in the first place. Next, we're going to define our vision. And remember, our vision is that place we're trying to get towards, that result that we're trying to accomplish, that impact we're trying to make. So where are you trying to go with this? What impact are you trying to make? And what do you want this to look like in the long term? Keep that bigger picture in mind. Keep that, again, long-term goal in mind. And think about your vision in terms of that end result. And finally, we're gonna draft up our mission. How are you going to reach that vision and fulfill your purpose? Again, this is the how, this is the actual strategy and mechanics of it. This is what we're going to do in the shorter term and in the smaller chunks to actually reach that long-term vision. Start to think about things like who might you need help from? What kind of tools and resources might you need? What sort of operations or strategy might you wanna put in place to be able to actually work towards that vision? And while we're thinking about all this on the company scale as well, also focus on what is your personal role in that. Now with all that said, work on this for a little while. Start to write down your ideas, brainstorm a little bit, and then maybe step away from it for a day or two and let your subconscious kind of chew it over for a little while. You might not have this you know, perfectly defined all in one go. Take your time with it, 
kind of keep tweaking it until it really has that meaning and that that feeling that you're going for that really truly speaks to not only yourself but also your company and your audience this is going to give you that clarity to keep you going keep you working towards these things to help your other team members understand what the whole business is about and why they should care why they even want to be working with you in the first place and also it's going to help you communicate more clearly that message and that meaning to your audience and your customers i hope this was helpful i'm going to keep making content to help startups survive this difficult early phase, the ramen phase. So if that's you, you're always welcome here and I hope to see you in the next one.